currently on view in our main gallery is an exhibition of plein air paintings by Javon Lee, entitled Watershed. Known for his vibrant sense of color and textural application of paint, Lee has a growing reputation as a leading figure of contemporary landscape painting. His powerful work incites a visceral involvement with the landscape which is mirrored by his highly physical approach to surface and an intense plein air painting process. Lee's art is a visual testament to his close engagement with the land and his attunement to the diverse interrelated forces operating within it. By design, Lee's plein air practice requires him to paint the land as it changes before him. The sunrise as it illuminates the earth in the morning or an afternoon storm as it gathers strength before unloading or dissipating. Watershed stresses the powerful, interlocking forces at play in the landscape, suggesting that his paintings are but snapshots within a dynamic and ceaseless metamorphosis. Watershed is an exhibition about time and mountains and rivers and being human in the rhythmic landscape. It was made outdoors over the course of a year in Taos, New Mexico, along the banks of the Rio Grande and at the edge of its gorge, in a canyon descending from wilderness above Taos, and in spring-fed fields at the foot of Taos Mountain. Mountains harvest water from the sky and hold it in their lakes and snow fields and give it back to the land throughout the year. It courses down their slopes, recharges aquifers, feeds springs and fields, and collects into streams that collect into rivers that collect into great oceans. All the while, water is evaporating back into the sky to then return to us as clouds raining and snowing themselves down to the mountains. We live within the landscape such that often we almost forget it's there, save for a spectacular sunset or a foreboding storm. The grand and the dramatic capture our attention for good reason, yet the story of us of the landscape is also a story of the daily grind and the small miracles. Sometimes just showing up is all we can do, and maybe is all we need to do, to discover the miraculous sprouting out of the mundane. I spent 23 days painting at the base of Taos Mountain this past winter, from early January to the last hours before spring equinox, starting sets of usually three to five paintings that were later completed in my studio. Each group is a story of a single day as it evolved, and every painting in the installation iterates around shared constants, the mountain, composition, and format. The pieces are vignettes of time and change. They're homages to a sacred mountain. They're just colors and gestures. They're weather reports of inner and outer realms. Out in a whiteout, or the freezing cold, or in the middle of the night, or on a squally day, I felt a certain kind of hum humanness. Moving paint is difficult with stiff hands. It's hard to see in the dark. The weather is too fast to keep up with. It's not fun exactly, and it's definitely uncomfortable. But it's also the priceless, vital, potent confirmation of being alive and bearing witness through the ups and downs of one's bodily experience, moods, and personal challenges. They are nature too. They shape the mountain in the painting as the mountain shapes them. The mountain is never the same mountain, and we are never the same as we meet it day after day. To work in the landscape is to choose to engage unpredictability and subject art making to forces beyond one's control. In this, nature is a collaborator. It sets the terms. I bring my attention and skill set. Nature adds material and subject matter weather, form, life, light, dirt, bugs. It's unpredictable and leads to unpredictable outcomes. It's unceasingly fresh, yet innately familiar. The forces acting upon my paintings are the same forces that have shaped the landscape and sustained our lives since the beginning. In them is something of ourselves. Hopefully in the work will be something of them. 
Thank you for joining us on this tour of the Javon Lee Exhibition, Watershed. If you'd like to learn more, you may click the link in the description below to view an online catalog of all works in the exhibition. Thank you.